Hello, my pretties. It is Friday, and I actually got two boxes today, so I got a double feature today. Uh, but before I get into that, let's get into the informational portion of this video. Hello, my pretties. For anyone who is new here, hi, I'm Gladys. On this channel, I do unboxings, and on Tuesdays, I do a get ready with me. Another thing I do on this channel is mystery boxes. They are truly my favorite and I love them so much I have created my own. I do mystery box giveaways on this channel and uh, just yesterday started January's. If you would like a chance to win this box right here, just start with this video right up here and good luck. Now if you like me and my content and not just a chance to win, do all those things YouTube would like you to do and I would so appreciate if you could do. <sighs> like, subscribe, hit that notification button. Now, if you don't like me or my content, just move on to the next. It's okay. We all do it. We all know we do it. It's okay. All I ask is that you don't leave a nice comment because no one's got time for that shit. All right. So I have Addie this weekend. So we're kind of going to do... Hopefully a speed round, maybe, of, of these unboxings. But the first one I have is my regular boxy charm. They did make the box a little bit smaller, which is better. Here is the inside. My pen. Now boxy charm did go up in price. They said they wouldn't, but they did. Um, is that $28 as well? I can't remember. I think so. But I'll put that right up here. You still get five full-size items. This month's theme is Refresh. Nice, good, you know, January I have box number 32. First item was my choice item. This is from the pharmacy. This is the Filling Good Hyaluronic Acid Plumping Serum. They say this retails for $44. I'll have the price down there in case they are lying. Here, that is. Nice glass frosted bottle. The only problem is, is that as you're using it, you can't see through to see how much you've used. Uh, but I will be giving this a try eventually. I will put this in my stash and we will see how it goes. Next item is from Earth Harbor. This is the Nymph Nectar, a super Fruit Radiance Balm. This retails for $38. What is a Radiance Balm and where do you use it? I don't know. Ah, it melts across your face. Okay, so I'm guessing it's a lotion, like a gel lotion. Yes, it is a moisturizer. Ha ha. I will put that with my other Earth Harbor items. Next item is from Dragon Beauty. This is my first Dragon Beauty item. This is, ew, I don't like what it's called. Ew. Lip Job Liner and Lip Pencil Sharpener. Why you gotta call it a lip job? Uh, this retails for $18. Can I just say, holy crap, I was going to say, why such a long box for just a lip liner and a sharpener? Hold on. Sharpener is at the bottom. Here is the teeny tiny sharpener that like folds, you know, you can contain your mess. I like the container mess part. All right, and here is the extra long lip 
lip liner. Like, geez louise. Let me. Normal lip liner. This is a Huda one. This is the Dragon Beauty one. Why so long? I don't know, but I'm okay with it. This lip job, does it have a color? It says 2.cc. That's all it says, but it is a brown color. You know how much I love a brown. Oh, it's more of a tawny, like, a caramel brown. I will use that because, uh, yeah, I love a brown lip liner. Next, really? Next item is from House Labs. This is another one of their Glam Attacks. This is a liquid shimmer powder. Retails for $20. This one is in the shade Legend. What color is Legend? I have, what, three of these now? I have like a rose gold, I have a green, I think, or is it gray? This one is a gold, ooh. And with these, you can use these on the eyes. You can use this as a highlighter, as a, eyeliner many different uses here but there it is do you mm. yes i'm kind of like mixed okay i got a really nice pretty color did i need another one of these no i already know how they perform so it's kind of like 50 50. And my last item is from Aesthetica. Hold on, I gotta unbubble wrap it and take it out of the plastic. God. This is a cream contour kit. This retails for $40. Um, I don't really use cream contour kits because really, you're just one person. You don't need like 12 contour shades. But there they are. You have Eris, Chandelier, Wonderlust, Honey Love, Summer Nights, and Chic Parisian. I have what two cream bronzers the kkw and the trustique one and i'm completely fine with those i don't need this i really really don't not one bit so this is going to go into a future giveaway because i don't need it and i think 40 dollars is extremely high for this brand Okay, so I have a 3-2 split on makeup and skin care. Uh, while premium really knocked it out of the park, this is meh. This is meh. Okay, this is not extraordinary this is not the makeup products just aren't well I love makeup I love skincare these makeup items just aren't what I really want a lip liner well it is a brown I will use it the name is disgusting. Okay, a lip job.
Some people don't mind vulgarness. And, you know, to a certain extent, I don't mind it either. But I don't want to put anything on my face called a lip job or a glow job. Okay, because you know what it stands for. Yeah. Just the thought of that going on your face is just gross. And then I, I got a product that I have already received, be it, albeit in another color, which is nice. And then a contour. Oh. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm not excited about it. I will do a try on like I always do with the two items just so you can see how they work for me and what the actual color looks like on on the skin and not just my hand but this is this is no this is not anything to write home about okay this is not something boxy charm should be proud of not at all that's my two cents and I'm sticking to it. All right, with that, I'm gonna go and I will see you in the next one. highlight as well. It took a lot of the sparkle when I patted it in with my sponge, but that's okay. This lip liner, love the color. Um, I love how pointy and thin it was. So I was able to like really get close to my lip line. And I was able to fill in a bit. It wasn't rough or like, you know, pulled on my lips at, at all. It was creamy so I could, you know, move it around a bit before I put on the lip oil. So besides the name of it, I'm okay with it. But what do you think? I think this was a quick and easy one. I mean, it was only just two products. But yeah, with that, I'm gonna go. I will see you in the next one.